everybody. Welcome back to The Binding of Isaac. This is going to be the third and final episode I'm recording today on December 7th, 2014. And uh, I'm actually going to do a challenge run for you guys, and hopefully the one that I like is unlocked. It is. It's called Slow Roll. Although, oh, let me move the mouse off screen really quick. Although, I like to call it Imperial Star Destroyer because of that. Now, this is max damage with piercing shots, and I can one-shot just about everything. Uh, and I need this after last episode's crushing defeat at the hands of just some random thing in the basement. Or not the basement, in the womb, rather. Or utero. I don't even know what level I was on, that's how bad it was. <clears throat> in any case... This is, uh, this is one of those feel-good challenge runs where you can just be crazy and do absolutely nothing and still win. Um... So yeah, I'm actually going to try and get through this as quickly as I possibly can so we can go back to the mob rush room and beat the crap out of some more things. Because I know y'all want to see that. Especially with uh, Imperial Star Destroyer tiers. Which is actually the first time I learned on my solo playthrough how to get into the boss, or boss rush room. So, our first boss here is Famine. And... Fun. So, Death. Ball of Bandages. And this gives us a little bit of a defensive bonus. And because there are no item rooms on challenge runs, we can only get items from shops and other places. Uh, this counts as a... I don't know what this counts as. I don't know what I'm even talking about right now. I mean, I know kind of what I'm talking about, but I don't know what I'm talking about. Or what to talk about is probably the more apt way of saying that. Um, more of the crap rooms. More of the crap over here. Aya! That's the other thing. It takes a heck of a long time to uh, destroy things. Now I'm debating whether I should go into the shop or not, and I'm gonna say no, simply because I only have one cent. Meantime, however, the Imperial Star Destroyer within me is going to take damage, uh, like a scrub, and. Also clear out this room. Move on to the next room and continue to clear out with an Imperial Star Destroyer tier. hi -ya! That got all but one. And we have some ring flies over here. I think I can take them all out with one shot if I line it up right. Yes. Perfect. And whatever happened down here exploded this so we can get all that. And continue moving this direction, because the boss is not this, but there goes Lust. One shot. Paralysis. Uh, temporary pause in motion, and also I think a slow uh, to the end uh, for the rest of the game. Monstro takes probably about three shots, if I had to get... Yeah, three shots. And I shouldn't have taken damage. That was the worst damage. And we get an all-stats upgrade. So, as a matter of fact, this does make our damage better. It also makes our fire rate better. It makes our health better. So, this could be good, and it could be very, very bad. Um, I have to remember what I'm going to call last episode. Because I need to think of names now, which is not easy. <laughs> well, that was nice. Uh, we get two of spades, double our keys. That's going to be perfect, because we don't need them. Uh... I don't even know. There's just too much I need to do, and too much things I need to... Too much things. Too many things that have to happen... I'm not going to grab that health yet, because it would be a waste, first of all, because I'm only a half-heart down, and it's a two-heart thing. But I will go into the curse room, just to see what I can see. Two black hearts. 
That'll be nice. I'll take those. And then I will grab my 2 HP if the boss room is not this direction. Um, we're playing as Isaac. I think I already mentioned that because challenge run. Okay, those rooms always scare the crap out of me because I'm not exactly sure when the spikes are going to pop back up or not. Uh, and yeah, that was pleasant. But uh, yep, yeah, this is just a feel-good run. I'm not doing it for any kind of commendation or anything. I'm just, you know, having fun. Bringing my own spirits up after that defeat last time and, and you know, I want to be a feel better about my prospects going into the future of my Isaac. Mega Fatty. Horrible boss. I hate him. He is... He is not good. He has a, a ton of HP. And he has, like, this vomit attack that's really nasty as well. If, you know, he wants to show you. But he's probably not going to get the chance. I just killed him, so... We got a spoon. We get to go a little faster now. That's going to be a plus dodge into things faster. Uh, we're down three rooms. We have three to go. Technically, we're at Caves 2. What am I looking at? Time. We're at three minutes. This is going to be a really quick episode, so hope you all don't mind. Oh! Sweet. Uh, but not so sweet. I just lost all my protection. Uh, and here comes uh, the Imperial Star Destroyer. Back from the dead, back from the dead, back from the dead to uh, take out a lot of these little poop things. And well, apparently there was only one plausible direction to go, and I missed it three times. <clears throat> How I wish. My longing for all of those coins is great. But it's worthless to even try. Oh no. No! Ugh. I hate... I hate these enemies. Die. Now you're not gonna pop up because you're nasty looking. Pop up. Uh, quicker to the draw than you, you sucker. There's that. Grab another useless key. Go ahead and go this way. Take all three of those guys out. Oh, God, I need to really turn those off. I'm so sorry. I mean, I'm not going to now because I'm about to switch over to FTL videos, but which are less noticeable. So, um, as it so happens, it might be laggy, but uh, for FTL, we'll, well, well, I guess you'll see. And if, if you don't see, then uh, I've decided to scrap them because they're broken. Uh, and, and too laggy for, for YouTube. Um, so yeah, there goes Larry Jr. Not a big issue. Nothing's a big issue when you have an Imperial Star Destroyer. And I, I literally mean nothing is a huge issue because you're the hugest, you're the largest issue that you own. Uh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> okay, Gertie. Gertie's about a 10 shot boss. If, you know, you can actually hit her. Or him. Or it. You're just a giant meat sack, really. I don't even know what you are. I mean, you look like you have a stomach. That little brown thing. The orange thing on the bottom might be like a liver or a bladder or some sort. But the rest of it's just like a meat sack. But really, that's just not okay. So latch key gives us some HP and some key. Oh, well, not some HP, but some better luck and some keys. Uh, and we're moving down to depths one now. We are at five, almost six minutes in time. The mini map is gigantic, and I don't want it to be. And this will be a short feel-good episode. We'll leave it at that. That'll be nice. Maybe if I do one of these! I'm not even sure how I'm going to do this. It's like I have reach. Yes! Okay. Nope. 
Don't want any of that. No, 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 no. Goodbye, fistula. Oh, okay, that was not good. I'm not surprised that didn't hit. Wow! Mmm! God, my Imperial Star Destroyer is just not wanting to cooperate right now. Take my random useless bomb and move along. When all you gotta keep is strong, move along, move along, like I know you do. Uh, all American rejects there for you, if uh, if you didn't know. Their music that that was them. And uh, yeah, stuff, places, things, whatnot. I got nothing. I'm just spouting at this point because I have nothing. Like like I just said, I can't speak. Um, yeah. Bats. Okay. I mean, there's really nothing to talk about when you're destroying enemies this quickly. Um. La la. Sir Reginald the Fourth needs his evening dinner of Star Destroyer. Please make it so. Thank you. Uh. Um, first of all, that should have killed them. Second of all, that should have killed them. And thirdly, how didn't that kill them? Because fourthly, Star Destroyer. So I'm holding down the button right now. I'm literally holding it down. There's no real rhyme or reason to when these come up. It seems like it's random, at least. Uh, why not? I mean, I don't need the money for anything, really, so... Just bring the Imperial Star Destroyer in to uh, take care of this issue. Oh, this is going to take a million years. Bomb it and get it over with. You know what? Let's unlock all of these. I don't need keys. Keys are for the weak. Now I'm kind of wishing I saved my keys. For that key beggar. Ooh, steam sale. As if that would be any use to me. Um, so let's go ahead and play the key beggar a little bit. Maybe make the episode a little longer. Destroy some of this red fire. So I don't die. We'll go down to two. Oh, why, thank you. A tarot card. No. <laughs> I appreciate it, but no. Um. Alright, we're fighting the gate. Now, we fought this guy before. Uh, he has the crazy uh, brimstone ridiculous laser shot thing. I'm no longer holding down the button. I just kind of fire it every so often. Or, you know, tap it so I can do the damages. Look at him. He's got a little person inside of him. About to be hit. Yep. Saw that coming. And we get magic... No, blood clot. Damage and range up. Well, I'm not sure the range is much of a problem here. Uh, we're moving down, and this is the last floor already. So the faster we find the boss and kill her, the better. We are at nine minutes an episode. So, giant bloody Star Destroyer. That is amazing. Why did it only go bloody one? Oh, right. Okay, so I only have the one eye that does the blood clot thing. Look at that. If that isn't a testament to how amazing this, uh, this is, I don't know what is. So let's go into the double key room. Let's take a look here. We'll do that. Sure, we'll take Bob's rotten head. 
Sure, we'll take a bunch of useless crap. Sure, we'll blow this up. And what did we get out of it? Two parts. I'll hold on to it. Let's move. Oh, no. Why didn't you die? You should have died. Uh, Zombros, you have piercing shots. You should be able to... <clears throat> yeah. All right, we got some keys. We might as well check out the shop while we have the opportunity. We have sharp plug, a spirit heart, and a key. Let's just buy all of them. Oh, God. Now they're coming up. Okay, charge with blood. That means when I go down to zero, I can pay to get... Uh, not exactly sure what the key is, but it be like V or C or something. Uh, but oh well. So, first pathway, not right. Second pathway, could be better. Already. Third pathway, little haunt things. And a, a sucking thing. Nope, don't want any of that. Also, kaboom. And thirdly, kablam. Uh, sure, I'll take the fish head. That, uh, the, that spawns, uh, flies for me. And this is not gonna be that much of a problem. That's it. Come and get me. Because the flies do about the same amount of damage that, uh, you do. Uh, you gonna do anything for me, Ma? There we go. Let's see, we'll grab this, we'll grab this. HP tears up and shot speed down. We'll go, go ahead and come in here. Uh, oh man, there are so many items. So we have Eve's Mascara, Magic Fingers, Gemini, and, uh, this one. I'm going to take Gemini. Or, oh, Cancer. Right. Cancer is an HP upgrade. Uh, so, Cancer. I took Cancer. Why did I think that was Gemini? Am I really that bad at recognizing the signs? Like, that, that was uncalled for, first of all. Just the amount of bad, bad uh, mojo went on there. Uh, well, there's that. And where is Carrie and Queen? There she is. There's that. There's another spirit heart. I really wish I had uh, unlockables on, but I don't because it's a challenge run. Because this would have unlocked me uh, Lazarus which uh, as the player. So now I only take half damage, I think, now. Uh, so that's that. I will never need to... Uh, probably grab HP again unless there are more spirit hearts on the floor. Oh look, it's the other piece of Gemini. Hey Larry, how's it going? Ooh, you guys want to watch something funny? Let me get close, actually let me uh, shoot that and then get close to Fistula. One shot Fistula. If that isn't the most overpowered thing you've ever seen, I don't know what is. There goes Chad. There goes Monstro. Here comes Chubb. There goes Chubb. Here's Gertie. There goes Gertie. I mean, it might take a little bit longer than what I'm giving it credit for, but... Uh, this could take a lot longer than I want it to. Yep, here's uh, Gish and Monstro 2. <sighs> Come on. See, now I'm, like, bored. Like, I realize I've done so much, or I've done so well, that it's like, it's too much. It's I've done too well. There's no excitement here. It's just like, yeah, I'm gonna win. Why is there any point to anything anymore? Let me just one-shot 
everything on this great wave. <laughs> well, there that goes. There he goes. There those go. There, their nose goes. They don't have noses. That's why they go. Oh, I was gonna be like, hmm. There's the bloat and the mask. Did the Mask of Infamy just die? Did it just straight up die? I think it just died. There was like nothing there. Yeah, it must have. That's crazy. Things are exploding far too quickly. Like, let, let's just take a look at the uh, statistics here. Uh, things that explode should not explode this quickly. The amount of HP on this floor is also quite ridiculous. Because nobody's ever going to need any of this. Oh, look, more spirit hearts. Oh, there's uh, Bicycle Helmet guys done. A.K.A. Headless Horseman. I'm about to get my next item. Uh, okay. There that goes. Oh look, an eternal heart. And I got Mom's bottle of pills from that. Uh, so let's just take a pill. Let's, why not? Pheromones! Useless. And just because Bob's rotten head. Uh, where did I come in at? Where's the way out? Oh, there it is. And we'll end our challenge run there. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. We got Swallowed Penny in their change, exchange for that. Thanks for watching. Uh, I know that wasn't exactly the funniest episode or the best episode that you might be watching or want to watch, but uh, there it was. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!